But a bunch of activists, you know, just heard pipeline and they want to kill it. It's, it's going to hurt no one, no wildlife, it's going to be underground, they want to stop it. So they recruited a few local Indians to claim, oh, but these are our sacred lands, uh, as it came through one part of North Dakota. There needs to be a huge backlash against these idiots. We have to regain our ability to say, you are a nut, shut up, go away. No, there's some idiotic worry of some leak that will never happen a hundred years from now, and some Indians who stopped trashing and, and overhunting their alleged sacred lands uh, long enough to show up and protest have helped shut this down. It's, it was just their affront for the eco movement. Even after his own government won in court, Obama alone stepped in to stop it, against the wishes and the best interests of literally tens of thousands of people, because his eco-activist buddies managed to find a handful of Indians to cry over this. Indians from tribes that, by the way, trash their own reservations and overhunt and overfish their own sacred lands routinely. So yeah, these tribes are real nature lovers. I have said before, it is killing this country that we no longer just say, two crackpots, shut up and go away. And I'm serious about this. We have lost our ability, with all of our PC desires to be sensitive to every need and every voice, we have lost our ability to say, shut up and go away, you crackpots.